This is the day that we celebrate fathers and father figures for the lessons that they share with us and the guidance that they provide to us. Our own Leon Bibb has fond memories of his own father in his personal essay, The Tie That Binds. I have done this thousands of times, tens of thousands of times, stringing a necktie around my collar, flourishing it with a flip, and then neatly knotting the cloth at the neck. Simple, but when I first attempted to tackle a tie, it was with the unsteady and fumbling fingers of a first-timer. In my boyhood, it was my insistent dad coaching me. In my memory, I can still hear dad's voice. At a certain point in life, a boy needs to wear a tie sometimes, said dad. You've reached that point. But this is really about more than a tie. The necktie story introduces my thoughts on Father's Day. The day is set aside as a time to honor fathers, grandfathers, stepfathers, or relevant father figures. Throughout the world, there are similar Father's Day observances. The day honors the influence of fathers in society. Maybe you don't have Father's Day thoughts as precious and memorable as those of someone else, but perhaps there was a father-like figure in your life. Grandfather, stepfather, uncle, family friend, neighbor, educator, Maybe even an older brother played the part of father in your life. Each can be tied to your life, just as this necktie, my father's, is tied to mine. So on this day, I think of lessons learned from a man who taught me about discipline, kindness, and many other things I would need to understand as I followed the pathway from childhood into manhood. Decades later, I have become both father and grandfather, passing along to the next generation what was given to me. My dad died a few years ago, but his wisdom lives in me. Interestingly, most of what I learned from dad came from observing him. He modeled the kind of man I wanted to become. Through the years, the old photographs of dad and me become even more precious. So in my own maturity now, I am reflective and thank the man who gave me lessons of life and love and who pointed me in the direction I should go. So although I am in the simple gesture of tying a necktie, these are not just my hands fashioning the fabric. The shadow of dad's are there too, showing me as he did that first time. His were the same hands which nurtured and loved me and pointed me into my own future. A Father's Day story of a dad and a child. A story of the tie that binds. Happy Father's Day from Leon. From Leon. Wow, Leon, that was pure poetry. Yeah, he could tell a story. So this was Kaitor's first watch of, yeah, a, of a package by mm -hmm. Leon. And we always joke here, and I said it to you while that package was playing, is that Leon has such a presence and a voice that he could literally sit there and read you the phone book. I believe it. And I believe it. And it sounds like a song. But an impactful statement there, too, is, you know, father figures in our lives, whether it's our own father, maybe it's someone else you look up to, a different guardian, maybe it's just a teacher that you view as a father figure, they are crucial. I said, I already called my dad this morning. Yeah. You know, they're, they're all busy today, and I know that today is often can be a hard day for folks, too. Mm -hmm. um, maybe you can't be with your dad. Maybe your dad's up above, too. So. Of course. Happy Father's Day to everyone out there, but again, a wonderful piece by Leon. Yeah, and our bonus dads, people that are stepping in too, exactly. to be a dad as well. Mm -hmm. Well, 